Hi, hi, this, how are you doing? This is the Chess Geek on YouTube.com. I'm going to quickly show you here how to play Minesweeper. And this game is actually much easier than people think it is, and it's not really complicated at all. Now, what you just do is you just click any random square on the board. Alright, we got a small piece here to work with. So you can click, uh, oh, we got to start a new game. Okay. Here we go. Okay, we got a good piece to work with here. What you do is, oh, each square here, um, the flag means that it's, a, uh, that you marked it as a mine. And there's ten mines on this easy mode. And each square, each number one square means, I touch in one mine. So, th this, this square is only touching a square. <coughs> and they're telling you it's touching a mine. So, therefore you can infer that this is the square, because it's the only square it's touching. And the square that's touching is a mine. So all these ones are touching th that mine. Now this two here is touching two squares, and it's already touching a square. So it needs to touch another square. It's only possibly touching two squares. Now this one is only touching one. It's already touching one. You can go ahead and click this. This one is already touching one. Go ahead and click that. Now this uh this one here is very t uh, needs to touch one. It's only touching one. You can go ahead and mark that as a as um as a mine. And this one is already touching one. You go ahead and mark this one. And this two needs to touch two uh, squares. So you go to go. You can go ahead and mark this one here. And this one is already touching one. Mark this. And this one is already touching one as well. You can go ahead and mark this one. Now this one needs to touch one. It's only touching one. You can go ahead and mark this one as a mine. Keep in mind, you can mark anyone as a mine, but uh, it's up to your choice. You just don't go over any uh, my, uh, you don't go over anything and keep on right clicking until you get a mine. It's what you mark. Anyways, um, this one is already touching one. So you go ahead and click. You can go ahead and click this and this because this is already touching one and this uh. This is already touching uh, one, and uh, so these two would be not be uh, a mine. The, this uh, two is already touching. Okay, let's go to the three. It seems easier because this three is already touching three. Uh, it should be touching three, and it's already it's, it's only touching three. So you can go ahead and mark all these. And this two is touching two. You can go ahead and mark these three. Okay, now this one. I mean, this one is touching one, and it can only be possibly touching one, so you can go ahead and mark that. And this one, a uh, touching one as well. It's very uh, touching a mine, and this uh, one is very touching a mine as well. Um, well, I don't know what happened there. Well, uh, anyways, it's just that I won the game uh, because I solved uh, all the mines. <laughs> Now, I'm just going to go and uh, just play uh, it out and see if you can, uh, I'm not really that, I'm not really that great at this game, but I just know the basics. Um, let's see here. Um... Okay, there we go. Now, I hope you understand this game now. Have a good day.